poor Frosty. He didn't know about Jack Frost's plans. And even if he had known, he wouldn't have cared. For all his thoughts were about his beloved, still silent Crystal. Oh, gee, Crystal. I don't care if you're not all living. Frosty reached down and brought up a lovely bouquet of frost flowers, which he had made from the snow. And suddenly, as the wintry stars twinkled down, Frosty's gift of love, those simple flowers, worked an icy miracle. Happy birthday. Crystal, I've been waiting all day. What kept you? Oh, Frosty, I thought you'd never think of those flowers. There never were two happier snow people. Hey, everybody, we're going to have a wedding. A wedding! <laughs> Frosty and Crystal, what a happy, jolly team. Running here and there saying we're a pair. Happy birthday to a dream. Uh, what? Oh, that's impossible, is it, isn't it? Oh, you darn snow persons. Yes. That. I've been out frosting again. <laughs> <laughs>